fourth century fragment of a book written in the Coptic language, we have a new previously unknown gospel. Eight lines on the front, six lines on the back. The most exciting line in the whole fragment, however, is the sentence, Jesus said to them, to his disciples that is, Jesus said to them, my wife. What this does not mean is that Jesus had a wife. It's not evidence for us historically that Jesus had a wife. It's quite clear evidence, in fact, that some Christians, probably in the second half of the second century, that's between about 150 and 200 AD, thought that Jesus had a wife. We have, of course, in the last decades, numerous examples of these kinds of of things where they found Jesus' tomb, where they found James's ossuaries. I was extremely skeptical, and without actually too much trouble, I saw how the sentence is right in front of what's existing. That is to say, what would be in the missing part that fit with the mother was very closely related to a particular saying in the Gospel of Thomas. We spent several hours looking at this fragment uh, discussing it in every possible way, starting from the notion that it's a forgery, you know, and trying to convince ourselves, uh, you know, trying to make arguments uh, against that. But the conclusion was that it was authentic and probably fourth century. I was very interested in asking a question, when was the first time that we have evidence of that anybody actually said Jesus was not married? And I was surprised to find that it is indeed uh, right during the same period when we're dating this fragment. And so what we can see is that it's about 100, 150 years after Jesus died, before the question is raised, did Jesus have a wife or not? And when it is raised, it's tied to discussions, even controversies, even arguments, you know, that early Christians are having about proper Christian practice. You know, should Christians marry? or should they be celibate?